guys, we are super excited for today's video because we've actually done this song before. Uh, we did it way back early, uh, and we heard it from uh, Home, Home Free. Free. I yes. will not forget that one. Home Free, go rest high on that mountain. It was uh, amazing. It was amazing. The vocals were beautiful, and the emotion. That's I'm 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 actually prepared this time because I heard Home Free's version for it to be kind of an emotional ride. And so many times down the comments, you guys said, you have to do the original Vince yeah. Gill wrote this song. So we are here to do that today, but we hope you are all having an amazing day. If you are new here, it is your boy, Jay. And hey, y'all, it's your girl, Amber. We're here every single day with reaction videos suggested to us by you guys, our amazing RSR family. But y'all heard it, Vince Gill, go rest high on that mountain. And we, we've done it before. And he has such oh, a fantastic voice. A fantastic voice. So. Excited to see what we're going to get with the original. And again, Home Free. Oh, what, was theirs beautiful. was amazing. But it was it's always nice to go check out the original. And y'all asked for it. And y'all know the slogan. We got to give the people what they want. So we're here to give it to y'all today. Let's check it out. Still just has that soft, homey, genuine feel to it. Because I, I don't know if you can get better than the original. And I don't know who the other two singers were that, that, that joined him yeah. right there. But that part where they just go, the go rest high, that kind of climatic part in the song was so, so good. And we know this is about... Uh, his he dedicated the song to his brother who had passed. So, yeah, yeah. man, I I like this one. I, his voice is just so humbling, and it's so it soars. You know, it's really really beautiful. And you put out the lyrics of this song, it, it can't help but take you over. And one thing I noticed about Vince Gill on the end of some of his notes, he kind of has a little a little country twang. To I mean, the end of he them. honestly has a fan fantastic voice and this is only our second reaction to him but hearing it here i would honestly put him really high up there vocally as far as some of the artists we've heard because he carries so much with those soaring yet humbling notes and it's still giving you that emotion yeah it's very emotional gathered round your great degree wish i could see
it doesn't matter who is singing the song. It is. It, it, it carries. The it, same it, way. it carries, and it brings brings back. You know, I'm sure most of us have had someone very close to us that we've lost, and this, you know, it kind of kind of takes you to that place. You know, no matter what their circumstance was, you know, they're they're going to that that better place. They're going up up high on that mountain, and you know, me, it's like I'm sure so many of you others have things that you wish you could still say to that person or still ask that person. So. That, that song going into, I, I knew it was going to be emotional. I knew it was going to bring back a lot of memories as it did. But the way Vince Gill kind of kind of brought it to you with that voice. And again, I'm not knocking Home Free, not one bit. Oh, but, you can't. It's but, just, you have a respect for each yes, in its own right, you but know? Vince Gill with it, to me, was just, for, it, it was better. To for me. Vince Gill as one man to carry that same emotion and weight that uh, Home Free did, mm. I thought was, you know, truly, truly beautiful. But, you know, going into it, I said, you know, I know it's going to be emotional because I remember Home Free's version. Mm. But it's one of those things that I feel like no matter how many times you hear it, mm. if you relate to it, you can't help but um, be emotional about it. And it's it's funny for me because you guys introduced this to us at the beginning of our channel. Um, I had just recently lost my dad and I was pregnant. So the stage of grief I was at that point hearing it and then hearing it in the stage of grief I am now. Because if you've lost somebody, you know, there's different stages, there's different phases, different ways that you find um, uh, were able to cope and accept it. And so the stage that I'm in now, hearing it, honestly, it brought a really beautiful smile to my face because that's kind of the outlook I'm at now. My dad told me, you know, he's going to be in a, a peaceful, restful place where there's no earthly drama. And so hearing that song, that really goes along with those same lines. Go rest high on the mountain. Your work on earth is done. I think the words are beautiful. The guitar was beautiful. The violin was beautiful. And you don't get much better He's than up that. there in the camo overalls. And then <laughs> camo overalls with no short underneath and it tucked into his dirty brown work <laughs> boots. Guys, thank y'all so much for that suggestion. I'm glad we could get to the original. As we always send you out of here, we love you. We thank you. We appreciate you. And remember, every single day that you wake up is a blessing and that you are blessed no matter the circumstances. And for you new family members that hit that subscribe button, you guys have a goal every day just like we do. Tell them that goal, Mom. Yeah, to make somebody smile, y'all. Until next time, we'll see you guys later.